my dear friends in this particular lecture we are going to learn a very very important topic of php that is session session is one of the most important topic that you need to learn to develop a php application so how the session is going to be used let me tell you in detail session is one kind of variable which is used to hold data for using the same in multiple pages so session are used as a variable to store data and that data can be used in multiple pages so let me explain you in the practical way so that you can understand the use of session variables so you can see i have got three files file 10.php file 11.php and file 12.php so let me first explain you what i have exactly written in the file 10.php now you can uh, see it's a very simple file now so first thing that you need to do you have to create the session so this particular command is going to create the session so okay so let me use a command this is creating session c r e a t i n g so creating session so this particular command is going to create the session so we have created the session so you need to write this thing to create the session now as i told you session is one kind of variable so what is the difference between the session variable and normal variable so you can see this is the normal way of declaring the variable so this is a normal variable so we have taken two normal variables so you can see name variables and occupation variable so I have, I have given a value so the name variable is going to hold a name that is Sogoto holder and the occupation variable is going to hold this value teacher so occupation is teacher so these two are the normal variables that I have declared now here I have declared the session variables so you have to declare the session variable in this way so this is the exact way that is how we have declared the session variable okay so the first have taken session variable name right and it holds Vishwajit Mukherjee and another session variable I have declared name occupation that is another session variable which holds the value student so here I have taken two normal variables and two session variables now in the same file I'm going to print so you can see by using the ego command I'm going to print the session variables so the variable which I have taken and given some value so here I'm going to print by using the echo command the session name this variable I'm going to print here so here I have declared the variable here I have declared this variable session variable and along with the session variable I have also declared the normal variables and here I'm going to print the session variable right you can see uh, both the variables I am going to print over here that is name and occupation those are the session variables and here I am going to print the normal variables so these are the normal variables which I have taken and those variables I am going to print over here you can see echo name and echo occupation those are the normal variables which I have taken I am going to print over here and that's all so this is a uh, file 10.php so let me first execute the file 10.php so I am going to execute file php now you can see i have executed the file in dot php now what we have seen over here so page one so you can see page one has been printed and uh, after that i uh, see printing session variable vishwajit mukherjee and student so those two were the session variable so we have printed this thing over here just see so uh, printing session variable followed by vishwajit mukherjee and student now if you go and see over here this 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 uh, session variables we have printed so Vishwajit Mukherjee and student those we have those values we have assigned to this variable that those are the session variable now let us see over here also we have printed the normal variables that is Sogoto Haldor and teacher now if you go and see over there so normal variables that we have designed Sogoto Haldor and teacher so we have also printed the normal variables right now now what is the exact difference between the session variable and normal variables that we are going to understand now now in the file fn what we have done see so here we have just printed the see we have printed the session variable and we are, we are also going to print the normal variables session variable we are going to print first and after that we are going to print the normal variables so here we have assigned the value now you can see over here we have assigned the value for the variables session variable and normal variables in file 10 
in the file 11 we have not assigned the variable we are just going to print right we have not assigned any variable values in file 11 we are just going to print so will it be possible now let us see so we are going to open the page 11 now just see now here is the difference that you are going to understand so as I told you session variable is used to carry value to multiple pages so you can see we can easily print the session variable so printing session variables we should use Mukherjee and student so session variables have been printed successfully but in case of normal variables we can't print now you can see over here undefined variable now undefined variable in line number 16 now see yeah see in the line number 16 this variable we have just tried to print uh, so it is undefined because we have not defined in this page right have I defined no we have not defined now let me show you another thing see notice uh, another given over here so undefined variable in line number 18 so just see in the line number 18 all copies of variable have been declared as undefined why is I you could just see over here undefined so we can't print the normal variable as we have not declared over here right we have not declared the uh, uh, the variables you can see we have not declared any variable over here but still we can print the session variable right we have not decided neither the same variables nor the normal variables in file 11.php but we can carry the value of session variable so with the file 10 we have declared the session variable that we can carry in file 11 also you can see here also file 11 we can carry we can print the session variable but not the normal variables so this is the exact difference between the normal variables and the session variables session by using the session variables we can carry data to multiple pages so that is the exact difference i hope you've understood now uh, let us see this file 12 so in the file 12 what exactly we have done see so session unset session unset means this is going to create all the data of the session so the session which we have created and the data which have been stored under the session variables all the data is going to be delete if you use this function so i'm going to call this particular function session unset in the file 12 i have written session unset so this session unset is a function which is going to delete all the variables so the variables which we have declared in file 10 uh, those session variables these two variables which we have declared and the value which we have assigned to it so all these things will be removed from the browser so let me tell you that all the session data are stored in the browser right so all the session data are stored in the browser and by using the session unset you can uh, remove and clear all those variables from the browser right so this is how we have to write when you are going to uh, clear the session data first you have to start the session and then you have to clear the session file 11 we are printing the session variables they are also in need to start the session so this this is very very important session start unless you start the session you can call this session variables also okay so let us now execute this file 10 now okay so now i'm going to execute this file 10 now you can see session data is clear now now if i uh, now want to open the uh, file 11 now if, uh, le let's see what you can see now you can see as the session data has been deleted session data are completely removed from the browser now you can see printing session variables here also we can't print the session because undefined index in line number 10 let me show you in the line number 10 undefined index because we have deleted the variables we have destroyed everything no data are saved in the browser so we can't print this this two now i hope you have understood if you like this video then you consider clicking the like button and share this video with your friend and if you have not subscribed to my channel please subscribe to my channel and support me thank you and goodbye for today